There they are. Only a hundred? So, yeah, That's just, not bad. That was probably like a couple of those. Okay. Yeah. Um, Put them away. Yep. I'm what is that eating. item? That item next to the wings? Uh, it's a pet name form. Oh, you can probably just store that. Yeah, I'll store that. Take up space. Is there any benefit of leaving my money? Yes, if you if you die, you will lose money. Oh. But, you know, we'll just we'll just we'll just not die. It's fine. I'll store five hundred. That's fine too. Cool. All right. I don't know if there's anything else here. We haven't found the the item for that NPC get boy. Uh, any other quest? I don't recall any other quests. Lake Tropica. What's this face door thing here? Face door thing? Strange passage. Yeah, I, I'd say that's pretty strange. Alright, Lake Tropica. Yeah. No, I've not been here. Lake Tropica. Yeah. Hmm. Old man. Pewter. Gooder. Well, now if it ain't Paco and Pipero. What up? Hello. <laughs> Guess you've started your search for the idols, huh? Quite the undertaking. Well, we've only just begun. Hope it goes well. That's for us to worry about, though. Just keep doing what you're doing there. Thinking of, what are you doing? Like, why are you here exactly? Walking around all the famous spots in Nargus is my hobby, my passion, even. Who knows? We might even run into uh, one another again like this somewhere, fate willing. So you're avoiding your mayor, mayor doodle, duties stuff. Not bad, but my paintings are way harder than this. Interesting. Anyway. All right. Mayor, mayor avoiding doing mayor things. Sounds about normal. Yeah, seems fine. Seems fine. Hold the ground. Oh. So yeah, I was I was a bit on a Helldivers uh, rant there, but it's it's a it's yeah. a good game. I'm I'm enjoying it. Uh, it's got the the community feel that I appreciated from Deep Rock Galactic, which I'm waiting for the sequel. Um, just the community and the way that the developers are currently progressing at releasing content just is a match made in made in hell diving. Mm -hmm. It's kind of a uh, this is kind of a gorgeous tombstone. Okay, looks like it's designed to somebody be placed on top of it. Four obelisks. <laughs> okay. And I, I, I think the way that Helldivers is accomplishing their goal is, is they're they're doing it pretty well, and it's uh, it's working out. I, I wish to see more things like that in the future, more systems. Hmm. I, and I suppose that that way, uh, you know, in that vein, that Guild Wars stuff uh, is, so is quite good. But, but I think the solution, good? I think the solution is to instance the content so like have a goal have a worldwide goal the players need to complete right and then like maybe a new for helldivers sake maybe a new planet gets unlocked um there's a bunch of planets already i just mean like that that would be the reward oh, i see what you mean like something that even if you come to come to the game later like the 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 existing levels themselves aren't changed. Uh, like I I don't know how the, how it works. Are there like missions you can go on that load right. in? Right. So, so imagine it's a okay. The way the game is played is you're in like your ship, and then you sure. select a planet or a front line to fight on. So you can either fight the sure. terminids right now. You could fight the terminids or the automatons. Sure. And so you go to select the area of the star map or like the planetary map. That currently is the active front line. Um, so you go to whatever front line you wish. Then you could choose your choice of a couple planets that are currently being either taken or defended or being liberated from uh, the enemies. 
And so... I'm not being damaged every time I'm standing here now. Okay, cool. No. Um, then you get to choose whichever planet. Usually there's like one or two of them that are currently active. Sometimes there's more. And then you like load into that planet and there's a bunch of mission instances that you join there for. Um, so you could, in, your, in what you're saying, uh, unlock a planet or so after, so after you finish liberating a planet, you unlock the next planet in like the um, supply line. And so you can go to the next planet and you keep going and so you can either, I guess, push push the enemies back, though the enemies fight back because the developers have lots of knobs and handles and stuff to turn up the difficulty. Yeah. Because recently, like, like as of like now or like, like yesterday, we got really close to pushing the automatons completely off the map. And so they've uh -huh. ramped up the difficulty of the automatons to make it way harder to do. Mm. And so... Um, they're, they're basically just, like, turning it up so that we can't 100% the automatons because that's kind of, like, antithetical to the game, like, its existence. But, like, in that way, like, rewards are turned up. It's just, like, a... It's it's a harder experience. Um, but it's kind of, like, in line with the game because they're like, hey, the automatons realize that they've been, like, losing a lot, so they're trying different tactics now. So they've, they've flavored it in a way that works with what they're doing instead of like just boosting them because they're losing because a lot of yeah. people are focusing on it. I don't know if I could try level four. Level you three. might be able to. Let's see if you can get in. Uh, I'm not allowed. Okay. We'll come back. So okay. you're, you're never, the, the level is a suggested level. You're only okay. actually locked by the, the, the locks. Gotcha. All right, was I barred from the door? There's a big ass door with a weird ass face on it. Yep. So it might be that you need to go back to the garden. Um, either the garden or to the serpent ruins there, because I need to find like a battery for the ruins, if you recall. Or at least I I recall needing a battery of some kind for that. Well, you don't have that, so. Yeah. There's a bunch of stuff buried here, apparently. Um, but yeah, I, I don't know the, what Helldivers could do. Oh, this is Serpent. Um, other than maybe, like, once we push really far into, like, another territory, they could unlock, the, like, another, like, faction that suddenly starts invading things because we're, like, busy looking elsewhere, and they're like, ha, time to have the ticket advantage of these guys yeah and honestly as long as that never runs out for the course of the game's life yeah that's a fine way to do it have the the map constantly be changing so it doesn't matter when you start because yeah like the fact that stuff happened in the past isn't really that relevant it's it's the game mm. is all about what is happening right this second and you don't have an advantage aside from like the fact that you have more resources of having played earlier. Right. That's the only thing that's, that's concerning. Like uh, that for, for, for Guild Wars uh, it, to go back to that, like, Oh, look at all this, like actual, like weapon armor skins, like stuff that you just can't get anymore. Yeah. I think the way they could do that is, you know how there are metas for maps, like the map itself has like a meta and like it progresses. Yeah. They could have a rotating oh, wait. thing. Talk, 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 talk. Oh, oh shit. Gone. I missed it. <laughs> I'm, I'm bad. Sad. Um, they could have a rotating meta. Meta. Yeah. And who knows? We could see something like that in Guild Wars 3. Because honestly, the meta, the, the meta structure is one of the... That, hey, you have 10 Takayaki now. You could just bail oh, out now and go... You could just bail out now. I, I you're on the first floor of the dungeon, though. You could just maybe do this and then come back. Yeah. I'll, Although you'd only have one healing item, so. Mm. Whoa, where'd all your money go? I, I stored 500. That's right. Yeah, I'm just leaving. I'm gonna go upgrade. <laughs> Good. And then I don't know how much is this one. Went from four to sixty, so it's probably what three to fifty or so, or fifty-five maybe. 
Oh, they're gonna be halfway to my next or, level. Or 45. Or 45. Uh, yes. Cuttlefish. Sounds good. Weird. Good looking cuttlefish. Yeah, 45. Yep. Times cool. times 10 and then times one. It's basically times 15. You're exchanging 10 for 15. So. I'm gonna go buy some potions. Even though I'd I mean, rather what, you have three, you have you have three healing items. That should be plenty. Well, I don't want to. I don't. I don't want to use the cherries. In fact, I'm gonna go put the cherries away. What? Just in case. Why? Because you know I flubbed two items so far. I'd rather not reload. <laughs> well, I just <laughs> mean I it's just... just a cherry. I mean. Because it's seven x. It's seven xp. Yeah. I mean, do what you like. I'm just. I'm just confused. <laughs> you. You have a. You have a. A logic behind it. You go. Go for. It. I'm not gonna stop you. I'm just. Well, maybe confused, I don't need all. to put it away. Just don't put it back on the hot bar. Yeah, just yeah, don't put it fine. on the hot bar. It's okay. one item. That's fine. If you start getting more cherries, then you can be more careful with them. But like, if yeah. you need that healing item in a pinch, then eat it. And I, I was fine. gonna, I was gonna buy like. Ocean. Yeah, except yeah, you can afford two. So. <laughs> yeah. And these don't even give experience. Nope, they're just healing items. Yeah, I guess they just not, don't have systems in place to like redo con like story like main story content in in the way that they probably would like to. Where we're we going? We're going to the room. Caverns. For XP. Or for loot. For money. Alright. Down this way. This, I want to do the labyrinth. Next one eighty. But it would, it would like I, I would like to see more systems like that in in games going forward. It's definitely a better experience, in my opinion. Though some games are just not meant for it. For sure. Cat, what are you doing, cat? Walking down a road. Nice. Ah. How much was the Labyrinth 1000, right? What? The Labyrinth time, like the time Labyrinth thing 1000, right? I don't know. Okay, I think it's 1000. Has there been any gaming related news? There's always uh, gaming related news. Anything that's like important other than I don't know, I'll find out. some game releases. I'm just curious. What's going on? Hmm. These pots have nothing in them. Just to show their their worthlessness to uh, all of everything. Oh. What's up? Hello. Coffee's we're getting some news on Coffee Stain Studios new game. Ooh. What is it? It's called As We Descend and it's a deck builder. Huh. Oh, it's roguelike. Ah! <laughs> hey, I heard you like those. <laughs> Coffee scene's pretty good. Yeah. Oh, 
Oh, did you see Devolver release or published another game? Pepper Grinder? Yeah. Yeah. Um, Thoughts on that it? one I'll definitely be playing. Like hundred percent. The 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 um Burrow mechanics in Ori and their predecessor that they were uh, inspired by the drill power up in Sonic Colors uh, are always really fun to play with. So, this. That'll be good. I think I recall the power being in Shantae. Shantae? In one of the power, in one of the Shantae games, I think. Um. Was it Pirate's Curse? No. What? The more, more recent one? What? Not like the... I, I, I recall a movement ability like that being in, in one of the more recent Shantae games. Unless I'm totally off the mark there and I just... Some reason I'm equating the two. I don't. Yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. Oh. Okay. Well, then maybe I'm just wrong. I'm trying to think of what the, what that could be. I don't think Shante ever had any like digging abilities. I'm lost on that one. Okay. Well, maybe it was like it's just a, like a down slam ability that I'm waiting. Yeah, um, Shantae Elephant uh, Power has a ground slam that can dig up items, but that's not anything close to yeah, the maybe mechanics that, of, yeah, of Pepper Grinder here. Remembering. Yeah. How are the review for Pepper Grinder? Uh, well, I can find out. And or the Steam Percent. Yeah, Steam Percent. Uh, 86%. Not that many reviews, I guess, because good, it though. came out only two days ago. But 86 is pretty solid. 86 is pretty solid. Yeah, honestly, I don't even check. Metacritic or stuff anymore. The the percentage on Steam. the positive percentage on Steam is usually pretty indicative of if I like a game. It is typically. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Uh... We'll go back to the ruins after this. Sure. Do whatever you like. I'm scrolling through. Scrolling yeah. through some news. It's a lot of dragons, dogma two, or hell divers two stuff. Yeah. Fun. Put that away. Oh, boy. Oh. Great, it broke and isn't loading anymore. News. Load more news! There's no one down here anymore. Oh, no one here. Cool. Save. And leave. Uh, nowhere. Fool. Birds? What? Yeah. Rap.
traveling places. Let's go. The site seems to be broken, which sucks. Nice. Uh, I can't load any more news. Even Love though there's that. supposed to be more news to load. No more news. Not loud. Yeah, there's no more news. That's sad. Level five. I have to hear this. No, I need a water key. Water key. Ooh. Level eleven. Twelve. And back up. Oh. Yeah. Right here. Ah, uh, that's still. Dang. Yeah. <laughs> also talking, Yaki. Places. Uh, remember when I only did one damage to this poor guy? Yeah, isn't it great that like Falcom damage scaling still it works in this game? Oh yeah, <laughs> real nice. Gain you gained what? One level? Two levels? <laughs> two levels. Uh... And you're doing ten times the damage. Seven Takayaki. Or, Bad. yeah. Oh, that's right. Lollipops. <laughs> yep. Good uh, fodder for healing. I don't like how faces don't show up as my enemies. Why does he keep trying to lie to me? They're actually that stealthy. Oh, uh, I see. I need a. I need the eyes two hundred instead of one hundred. Gotcha. Yeah. Thirty-one. Okay, I'm a little lost as to what to do now. So I do, I do, I guess I, I have to go to the labyrinth. Um, because that's the only other place I haven't been to to go do things yet. Okay. This will just take you to the midpoint. You already flew there, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm trying to leave. Oh well, that's one right? right there. There you go. Cool. Can I sell stuff to you. No. Oh, something to you. Yeah. That's not terrible. Yeah, but why would you sell them? Other than they're the only items I have to sell. <laughs> but what do you what do you need money for? I need one thousand gold in order to go buy s entrance to. Okay, well, you, that's clearly not for right now. Then don't try to force the money. Yeah. Sure, this is what they actually sell for. Sold for fifteen. This sold for. Yeah, don't don't sell don't sell your experience. It's not 
a good, not a good plan. Get hungry. All right. Or, uh, I forget if I have a journal for like the quests or if I just have a. Uh, I'm no, you don't. No. Nope. Okay. All I know is there's this boy in town that lost something. I need to get this maybe. Ah, uh, well, I just get. What are you looking for, kid? Uh, don't mind me. Oh, maybe, maybe I stole his boot because I found something down here in the corner. And it was a boot. Maybe his boot is something that he lost and I, I already took it. I don't know. Um. All I know is I'm a little lost as to what to do. Other than I need like a power thing and I need to find access to the labyrinth. Maybe I can go to the desert? Oh, bizarre. Uh, what's... Dynamite? What's in your inventory right now? Wait. <laughs> what? Huh, you don't have the glove. Maybe I need to go talk to NPCs. Yeah. Wait, where's the forest? Maybe you missed the forest. Did I miss the forest? Uh, is Did there... You know? No. Oh, hell. That's a single tree. <laughs> On a hill. Um... The, the forest <laughs> might be to the... Right, like, right there. There? Yeah, you missed that. Oh, oh, I did miss this. Cool. Yeah, there we go. Okay, good. Level... Yeah, level, level zero. zero. Yeah, this is where we were supposed to go first. All right. Oh, ooh, a door. All right, let me go look around first. Here we go. Here's level zero. <laughs> level three. I can't, uh, I can't go in here. Cool. Nice attention to, nice attention to detail game. Level 33. 33, but there's an up path as well. And I don't mean, I don't, I don't just mean this one. Yeah, 10. Oh, let's go to the right, cat. 20. 20. I wish you would put the numbers on the map. Mm. Like what level what range do? it is. <laughs> I know. Ooh, save point. Save. And it's out. Okay. Well, let's do the zero. Yeah, here okay. we go. This is what we've been missing, for sure. Oh yeah, they died one hit. <laughs> you were playing on hard mode. What? Crazy. I know. <laughs> they died. They died one hit. Oh. It's great. It's great. Yep, and here's the, now you're getting a bunch of lollipops. Uh, yep, take the rice balls out. Because that's a, that'll at least be 30 experience. But you can see how the 1.5 multiplier from uh, uh, experience just kind of ramps up. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Slaughter them. Anyway, that's cool. Yeah. There we go. See, they're so stunned that they don't realize that they're dead yet. They don't drop their money. That, that is that is how that works. Can confirm.
What? Oh, talk. Oh. I think the cat chose to talk. We're fine. I think so, too. Into the corner shroom. Receive food. Nice. 